All right, everyone, we're back with more Soma. Uh, we just made it back. I think we're back in Tau, right? So, um, I guess we still have our legs. Fly, right? Oh, fine. Hope the Ark made it here in one piece. Well, that's a dive room. Yeah, can't open that somehow. Service area. Hello? Ah, uh, good old Catherine. Chris, what the hell happened to your arm? It's complicated. I just need to know one thing. I'll have both my arms in the Ark, right? Yes, of course. Are you okay, though? Can you do stuff? Yeah. Let's just get this over with. Did you find the Ark? I did, but I kind of lost it on my way here on an automated tram thing headed to Phi. So it should be around somewhere. That's great. Let's go get it. Okay, yeah. Not really. For some reason, they didn't go through with the launch, so they took the Ark back to town. I hope everything's okay with the space gun. Yeah, I doubt I'll be able to repair one of those. <laughs> oh God, I'm really slow with only one arm. Hello? I can't repair myself, can I? Oh, it's spreading everywhere. This feels like the longest day of my life. Has it just been one day? I have no idea. Our time together is a confusing patchwork of moments to me. What time is it then? What day? It's May 11th, 2104, 3.30 a.m., but I don't remember when we started. You know, I woke up in my bed today. It just happens to have happened a hundred years ago. Sounds like a real. It does. I woke up in my bed today, a hundred years ago. Who am I? Who am I? Oh. Are you suggesting we keep it down here? Doesn't that defeat the whole purpose? Eternity among the stars, remember? The people inside the Ark won't know the difference. We can just keep it down here, and we don't have to risk the Ark being shot through 5,000 meters of broken barrel, and then push through another 100,000 meters of a dust-filled atmosphere. Will the casing stand all that pressure? Well, the odds aren't great. Catherine, say something. I don't care what you think. I'm launching it. No need to be like that. Let's just hang on to it for a while and think about it. We can launch it later. No, that wasn't the deal. Uh... We needed to save them, to launch it. Out there, it's hope. Down here, it's a fucking terrarium waiting to die with the rest of us. Come on, Catherine. It's not asking much. Let's just think about it before we risk the only hope humanity has to survive this hell. No, we launch it today. This is my project, my arc. It's bigger than that. Don't you get it? It's not for you to decide. We're talking about the fate of mankind. Get away from the arc. I'm taking it. No, you're not. I'm not gonna let you ruin this. Oh, the killer. Stop it. Guys, calm down. Get away from me. No. Oh. What the fuck did you do? It was an accident. Catherine, talk to me. Catherine. Oh, well, there's God. Catherine. Catherine. Did you say something? It's you. You had an accident. What are you... Oh. You mean Catherine. Don't worry, it's better this way. What? How does that make sense? I'm sorry. Tripping over your body. 
think I found the assembly space. What do you see? It's like a huge open shell, a bullet ready to be loaded. That's great. All prepare for the arc. Right. I'll go pick it up. Um. How did she die? You got into a fight with your colleagues. They didn't want to risk launching the Ark. Thought I might not make it through the atmosphere. They killed me? I'm sure it was an accident. They were just trying to stop you from launching. So where? How could they kill me? Catherine. I know I'm not an easy person to like. I just thought they trusted me. Come on, don't do this to yourself. Okay, wait. Do I have to go back and I have to yank the power back out of it? Okay. Because apparently this whole place is battery powered. Which makes wonderful sense. Did you have friends in Toronto, Simon? Real friends? There were some. Jesse, Sean, Kevin. I always wanted a friend. Like a real one. Someone you'd never hold back with. I'll be your friend. Oh, pity friendship. Now I feel even worse. Here it is. Uh, we got the arc back. Good job, Simon. Take it to the assembly space and load the bullet. Do you oh. think the arc will make it through the atmosphere and into space? No, this doesn't matter anymore. We just need to try. If we burn, we burn. If we're lucky, we just gave humanity a new chance, a whole new era. With the arc on us, maybe we have a few decades of power to keep it running. In space, we have thousands of years. Still, one hell of a gamble, though. This was never about certainty. It's about hope. Oh. Well. Sorry, I gotta go back to get the battery. Dun 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 dun. There we go. We're launching it out into space. Not only is this the future, it's in the middle of the sea. I know nothing of this time or what the world looks like. Not much to brag about now. Before the comet, I guess it was okay. Yeah. Better not oversell it. Might change my mind about the Ark. You seriously not going to tell me what happened to your arm? I had to make a quick stop at Site Alpha to help kill the WoW. What? How? Why? Stop it from torturing the memory of humanity. Okay, let's just get back to work. <laughs> what will you do when you get All into right. the Ark? What's the first thing? Make sure the Ark is safe, stabilize flight path, activate solar panels. Well, what's the first human thing you're gonna do? Oh. Watch the clouds roll by. Well, how do Does I get back out? I'd say so. How do I get out? Oh, there it is. Gimpy arm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Something's gonna happen. Now what? Now we just need to get the shell into the gun and then kaboom. Aren't you forgetting something? How are you gonna get us on board the Ark? Don't we need to make another scan? Oh, uh, don't you worry. You don't operate something like the Omega space gun with your bare hands. You mean... It's a pilot seat? Like back at Omicron? Yes, and we can use it to transfer you to the Ark mm. while operating the gun. Two birds and all that. Now, take the Omni tool and plug it in next to the seat and I'll guide you through the final steps. Alright. How, how do I get there? Site map. Uh, storage. That's a launch dome. Okay. I 
incoming activity. Mission completed. Remote sensing satellite. Okay. Ten years of impeccable operation on Omega Space Gun will shut down. But it took an apocalypse to make to be made redundant. Okay. this area too? A lot of water. Kissing. Oh. Oh. I'll never get used to that. Guess you won't have to. Not after this is over. Good. Okay, I'll have to uh, take this okay. You should be able to use the machines to load the bullet you assembled. Okay, before anything else happens, this is my prediction. She's gonna make a copy of me, put it inside the ark, and then I am left inside the seat. That is what I'm thinking is gonna happen. Before you guys do anything else, watch this episode. Predict what you think is gonna happen down in the comments. That's why I, I, I mean, this game's dark. I'm going to say right now. Don't know, I never tried this one. But pilot seats are notoriously easy to use, so it shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> okay. Okay, I can't lower it anymore. to transfer our minds to the Ark. We also need to make sure it launches at all, so I tied them to a single switch. Just push the button and we're off. Okay. Here we go, no turning back. Thank you, Simon. Don't mess. It's an amazing thing you did. I want you to know I appreciate it. Seconds. What's the matter with the upload? Just give it a second. I thought you guys would have better bandwidth in the future. 
she's doing fine. Ten seconds. Nine. Eight. Seven. Yep. Six. You gotta be kidding me. Five. Four. Three. Two. Come on, hold! Two. Yeah, we made it! Woo! Nope, I'm still here. I'm still here. Yeah. I'm still here. Catherine? Catherine? I'm here. What the hell happened? What went wrong? Nothing. They're out there, among the stars. We're here. No. We were getting on the Ark. I saw it. It finished loading just before it launched. Yeah, I saw. Then why are we still here? Simon, I can't keep telling you how it works. You won't listen. You know why we're here. You oh, you son of a gun. You just didn't carry over. You lost the coin toss. We both did. Just like Simon and Omicron. Just like the man who died in Toronto a hundred years ago. No, this is bullshit. We came all this way. We launched the Ark. I know it sucks. But our copies are up there. Catherine and Simon are both safe on the Ark. Be happy for them. Are you crazy? We're gonna die down here with those fuckers living at large on a spaceship. They're not us. They're not us. I'm sorry you feel that way, Simon. I'm proud of what we did. We made sure that something of the hundreds of thousands of years of human history survived, that something lives on. No, 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 no. Fuck this. Fuck. Yeah. Fuck this. Fuck you. Fuck you, Catherine, you lied! And I believed in you, I trusted you! You said we're getting on the fucking Ark! We are on the Ark, you idiot! I didn't lie! I can't be responsible for your goddamn ignorance! You fucking Ark! Catherine? Please don't leave me alone. Catherine? Catherine? Nope. That's the end? Ah, oh, come on, man. Well, there you go. All right, everyone. So, I mean, that's Soma. Interesting. I mean, I, I knew it was going to happen. Like, I knew we were going to get screwed over in the end. <clears throat> but I had hoped that, like, if nothing else, we would at least be able to like venture out in our apocalyptic world or something right i mean there would still be life life for simon he could still adventure he could still go see things and that's that's what i wanted to see out of it i i wanted to see this simon continue on I mean, Catherine, I didn't give, a, didn't give a damn about Catherine. Catherine was a homicidal maniac throughout the whole damn thing. You know what I mean? But that's what I wanted to see. I wanted to see him get his arm repaired or at least wrapped up or something. And then I wanted to see him walking out in like an apocalyptic world. Just walking up onto the land and just walking off. That's what I wanted to see. So, th there's some bits of it that don't make sense to me, right? Like, how it said, like, you, we lost the coin toss. We didn't. Okay. You, it, it, you wouldn't, there would be no coin toss in this. It's not like, um, what's that show? Um, the Magician, right? The movie. Like, how, you know, spoiler, right? If you haven't seen The Magician, you don't know what I'm talking about. But, like, for me, there would be no coin, coin toss. If you're basically, all you're doing is taking a copy of someone's brain and then moving it somewhere else, that copy moves on. Whatever was the original thing is not moved on. So, it's like, the game makes it seem like there's a coin toss. Like, it's a 50-50 chance if you're going to end up in the spaceship or on the... 
on uh, stuck there in the seat, and that's not the truth. Is it? It's not going to work that way. I don't know why she can't ever flip and just transfer our consciousness. <gasps> oh, come on. Hello. Can I get up? Whoa. Is this... Did it work? No. This is not the Ark, Simon. Okay. Maybe it is the Ark. We gotta explore a little bit. We've got God rays. All kinds of stuff in here. Oh. Welcome. If you're reading and successfully entered the ark. Survey is designed to give you the developers a better understanding of your subjective experience. <laughs> no, we've already done this. It asks you three times in the game. Again, three. Uh, how are you doing? Asks you about your experience. What if there's like no one else here? I also would like to notice that I'm not breathing. Catherine? Even though Catherine. I can't believe we actually made it. We Well we didn't. did. I'm so relieved. It's okay, Simon. Everything's alright now. Like, my, my thought is, is like, especially if you're inside a, a mechanical suit, why, why couldn't Simon get out onto the, like, onto land? You know what I mean? And like, make a new robot colony. You know? I don't know. So that's it. Well, all right, everybody. I mean, all right. So we're just gonna exit out of this, okay? Now, here's the issue I have with this. Okay, in the game, it keeps referencing. Now, I mean, all in all, the game is an amazing game. Okay, it really is. It's just the thing that bugs me is, okay, that they have somehow developed this technology that completely scans people, like, 
there's like they call it brain scan right but basically what they're doing is they're transferring or they're making a copy of someone's consciousness and it's storing it right okay so as you go throughout the game there are people we meet that like there's a there's that one guy and there's like two people that were stored on like just like a hard disk just sitting there right and what happened to them they're just never turned back on right but then my my thing is this: if they were able to be transferred onto a hard drive, right? Obviously, the game awful re re uh, references that these people would kill themselves after they're scanned because then ultimately they would be on the arc. It, it doesn't work like that. Okay, the logic isn't there. If they are making a copy of your mind, right, your consciousness. And then instead of just transferring your consciousness, it that would be basically like there's two of you, right? And it, it, even in the game, Simon even references like, what the hell? There's two Simons. There can't be two Simons. That's really messed up. And she's like, oh well, he's sleeping, but he, you know, he'll wake up in like a day, a couple days. It's like what? You know? And I mean, basically, force was also ultimatum. Like either leave that Simon there. Or kill him. I think ultimately, knowing the end of the game, it might have actually been better to leave that other Simon there. That way you might have been able to make it back. Right? Well, you probably wouldn't have. Because I think that Simon... I, I think the Omni tool broke. So, yeah. I, I think ultimately, you would have been just screwed. The other Simon as well is screwed because he can't open up any doors or anything anymore because he doesn't have an Omni tool. So he's literally stuck in that room and t unless you like came back and got him, which wouldn't be a possibility because you, your Omni tool is now broken. So ultimately, you're just both screwed. And so in my mind, it's like I don't know why they wouldn't be able to just transfer the consciousness instead of just making a magical copy. And, and that's the bit of the game that I have issues with. But, I mean, is it a thought-provoking game? Is it worth playing? 100%. It is a very good game. Um, it's spooky in a little bit, like, with the, the monsters coming after you and stuff. But honestly, more more so, it was more of a thought-provoking um, thought provoking game. So, I think, in the end, like, I definitely recommend people playing it. But, like, yeah, I don't know. There's a lot of... Like hemming and hawing, I guess on it, and it's like, uh, on like the philosophy. I mean, not not in the game itself. The game is awesome. I think the game executed really well, but um, the philosophy behind it, it, it's like Catherine in the end saying like, "You lost a coin toss." There is no flipping coin toss. Okay, it doesn't work like that. It, it's just how the game portrays it. Like when we moved into the other suit, the game portrayed that we our consciousness shifted to the other suit. It wouldn't have. If you go into the chair and they make a copy of your brain, you are still in that chair. You are not in the other chair. That's somebody else. Okay, that's how it would work in reality. It's the way I see it. Right. It, you if you made a copy of your brain, put it inside of another like a suit or another body or whatever that. That other that copy is another entity. It's not you. You were still stuck there in the chair. So basically, Simon had a copy made of himself, and then that copy killed the first copy, which was a copy of the original Simon that died 200 years ago. Kind of crazy. Kind of crazy to think about. But all right, everybody. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, um, if you made it through my ranting. <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoy my ranting a little bit, but um, yeah, I mean definitely um, Hopefully you guys didn't like it hit that like button comment what you think about the game I, I think it was a good game the philosophy is interesting like I said, but um, yeah What do you think about the philosophy? What do you think about the game in total and? Um, comment all that down below and then definitely subscribe. We got more fun games coming up and uh, Hopefully you guys did enjoy and we'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye